welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do what's in your refrigerator. I get a ton of emails, I get a lot of questions about, hey, what do you do um, to stay fit? What do you eat daily? And if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I do a lot of stories and I try to like talk about what I eat, um, what I'm eating for lunch, what I'm eating for breakfast, and like tips and tricks that I do. Um, to kind of like try to stay fit and in shape. It is no secret that I have been um, struggled with my weight over the past few years, several years, and I have um, been very open about it, um, about my journey and about my ups and downs and my struggles, if you will. So I thought it would be really fun to take a peek inside of my refrigerator and kind of just see what what I have in there. So. Um, one thing that I do is I juice. I juice probably, I try to juice like two or three times a week. Um, my whole family juices. It's something that I have just incorporated into my daily life. Um, it's something that I have really, really seen huge benefits from. So you will see a lot of fruits and vegetables in my refrigerator. Um, I try to eat organic. I try to as often as I can. That's not always possible. Um, I really try to take my carbs to a minimum. I do eat carbs, but I just try to eat 100% whole wheat, things like that. Those are things that I have found um, work and do not work, things like that with my body. So let's get started. All right, so I'm gonna try to show you the very best I can. This is the inside of my refrigerator. Um, I'm going to take the camera off and be able to show you individual um, shots and kind of walk you through what's in there and why I choose um, those items. So we'll start here at the top. Um, up here I have chicken, chicken legs. We like to grill a lot. It's becoming nicer outside the spring weather, but we even grill in the winter. Um, my kids love this. This is bacon. And this is just some burgers to grill. I typically like to eat turkey burger. That's really what I usually do, but my kids really like this, so um, that's, I eat it too. Um, when I do grill burgers though, I typically leave the bun off or um, I eat 100% whole wheat, but I really don't use a bun. Over here, I have hummus. I love hummus. There's a ton of things I do with it. If you follow me on Instagram on my stories, you've probably seen the little things that I've come up with using hummus. Um, this is the garlic hummus. So actually, this is the garlic and clove. Is that what it, ch oh no, chive. Um, I love Trader Joe's. These are not from Trader Joe's. This one's from, I don't know, it might be from Whole Foods. I can't remember. But anyway, um, I love Trader Joe's, but these are the ones that I have right now. Let's see. This is just um, French onion dip. I like to eat that. It's really good with vegetables, and so is this hummus. I like to dip vegetables, carrots, um, in it. Okay. So now we will come down to the milk. I do not drink a lot of milk, but my kids do. Um, I do like this um, organic only is all that we use. Um, but you know, cooking with it as well. These little water bottles are for my kids. Um, they take these to school because I do not allow them to drink out of the water fountain. So I always throw one of these in their bag so they have it in case they do get thirsty. Back there is my creamer for my coffee, which I cannot live without. <laughs> um, creamer is not great, but I don't care. It's one of my things that I just, I'm okay with and I do. This is wheatgrass. Um, I typically get it in the actual, um, package. I'm gonna get it from Whole Foods, but I ran out and I found this at Schnucks. I've used it before, so this is actually real living wheatgrass. I use this for my juice. This, and I juice this actually to make wheatgrass shots. This stuff is crazy, crazy, amazingly healthy for you. Um, if you get a chance, look it up. Look up wheatgrass benefits and you will just absolutely be floored with what this little green grass um, actually does for your body. It's a superfood. It's amazing, and I always like to incorporate it into my juice. So behind this, we have our tub of butter, and I like the Lando Lakes brand and with the canola oil. Uh, over here, we have our Greek yogurt. This is um, this is a new one I just got. It it has berries, and then usually I get the strawberry. Um, and I usually put, uh, what is that? 
um, granola in it. I love granola. This one right here is one that my husband just tried, the banana cream. That's not my thing, but that is something he likes to have. I eat this for breakfast, I eat it for snacks, and I eat it um, sometimes just late at night when I'm craving something sweet. And over here is more yogurt. Um, I don't eat this. This is for my kids. My kids like this and so does my husband. Um, but I typically just do the Greek yogurt. I usually do the vanilla, strawberry, um, or I just tried the berry and it was really good. Down here I have um, corn on the cob. This is something my kids love. I don't really eat a lot of corn, but this is what I grill for them. They love it with um, salmon, which we'll get to in a minute. Over here we have the organic baby spinach. I eat a ton of ton of salads um, using spinach and I just I use this a ton. Over here we have black or let's see blueberries and raspberries. I sometimes add this to my yogurt too. If I just have um, vanilla Greek yogurt then I'll just add some berries to it. Um, it's just nice to have on hand. Over here is the leftovers from last night. We grilled salmon and corn on the cob. My kids, this is one of their favorite dishes. Okay, that noise is my refrigerator door saying, hey, I've been open too long. So anyway, this is what it looks like. We just grill it with some lemon um, seasoning and fresh lemon slices. It takes like 10 minutes to make. It's amazing and I just love it. Um, I put it in salad too. I make salads with it. I eat it by itself. Here we have celery because I do make a lot of soups. Um, I like my chicken noodle soup and that's and it's also that's also great with almond butter and peanut butter. Down below, this is the drawer. I usually um, try to keep all of my Green Chef um, supplies in or my ingredients. Green Chef is an online um, subscription service, food service. Um, Green Chef is all organic and they send you each week. I get three meals and it is um, everything I need for each meal with a recipe card. I've been doing it for over a year and a half. I love it, love it, love the service. Um, but you can see how convenient it is. All ready to go. Like labeled, I know what to do and each meal takes 30 to 45 minutes to prepare and make and we just love it. Um, over here on this side, um, I have all flour already crumbled up, um, shredded cheese, um, turkey pepperoni. My kids like this and when we make homemade pizza, I use this. Um, some overly, some crescent um, rolls, which I make my egg muffins for the morning. I make pre-make those. Um, this is what I use. Some onion, some deli cheese, more onion. That's it. Down here, I typically keep all the stuff that we juice. Um, so we'll start over here. So I always juice with carrots, and I try to get the organic and cucumber. Um, these baby carrots I use for my hummus. I use for corned beef when I make that in the cr on the pressure cooker. And this is kale, I juice with this. Um, lemon, I juice with. And um, grapes, my kids love to have grapes. I try to put them in baggies so they're really convenient to grab and go places. I can make them a little snack bag and they're just easy, easier than grabbing chips, or healthier anyway. Um, and then Brussels sprouts, I found these half Brussels sprouts. They're already cut. Um, I think I found these, I think they were at Walmart. Um, I love Brussels sprouts. I roast those in the oven and they're just yum. So that is for the main part of the refrigerator. We'll go over here. This is where I keep, let's see, I have lemon, fresh lemon, ju or lemon juice. Um, oh, that's butter. I don't know that, I didn't know that was in there. Um, this is medicine that I have to keep refrigerated. Down here is wine, butter, <laughs> that I cook with, um, some black beans, more butter, pumpkin and apple, um, apple butter. My husband likes to eat that with biscuits. I don't typically eat that stuff. Over here we have the condiments, so we have, oh, now I do love this stuff. This fruit and honey triple berry, oh, I love to eat this on 
bagels or um, bruschetta like bread type things. Now I do I do like to do those in the morning when I make brunch or things like that. And this is just Parmesan cheese. I make this on my nan bread with my hummus and red onions. I need to share these recipes, but I do on my Insta stories. So just so you know, <laughs> um, just more stuff, just uh, garlic, minced already garlic, capers when I make my salmon, bagels, um, uh, mustard, and then down here I have more wine because you know I love my wine. Um, ketchup and just the condiments. Now this stuff, I love these little things. I serve these in, at my parties all the time and when I have guests over. And this is the Elder um, and Rose Lemonade. Oh, you guys, it comes in a really large um, uh, bottle also. This is non-alcoholic, um, but it is a delicious, refreshing drink. Um, my guests always love it, but I like these because I can grab them and just have them like on the go or just at home without opening an entire um, large bottle. But they are great, great for parties. As you can see, they're gorgeous. They taste, taste delicious, and they're my summer and spring drink. Oh, my light went off. So now we're going to go down to the freezer, which is below. Okay, now down here I have Texas toast for the lasagna and garlic that my kids like. Again, I don't eat that either. Um, this is the bread that I usually get, 100% whole wheat. Um, so when I do eat bread, that's what I choose to do. This is shrimp. Um, I like to grill this. These are ginormous ones. Over here are just um, French toast sticks. I found those at Aldi's and my kids really like them. You bake them in the oven. Um, this is for, this is when I would make smoothies. I haven't really been into smoothies, but um, they're just nice to have on hand. My husband likes smoothies, so do my kids. So, um, oh, we, then also I have my homemade waffles, my heart waffles that I made over Valentine's Day. And these are great because I could store them. My kids just grab them and, and go. Um, more waffles from the store. Up here we have frozen peanut butter and jelly. My kids love these things. Tried to do the more healthier things, but this is what they prefer. So they eat healthy for the most part. So this is okay with me if that's what they would rather have. Over here is snow crab legs. Um, we like to grill these. My kids are huge seafood lovers. So we always have salmon, or we always like to eat salmon and crab legs and lobster. They, they like those things. Um, anyway, so that is my freezer. Okay, that completes my what's in my refrigerator and even what's in my freezer um, tour. Hopefully that helps um, give you an idea of things that I eat daily, things that I keep on my refrigerator, things that um, are important to me to um, lose weight and stay fit and things like that. Um, make sure you follow me on my Instagram stories because I always, like I said, do stories about what I'm eating and tips and tricks on things that I've learned um, along the way, along my health journey, uh, my weight journey. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will do more lifestyle things like this um, in the future. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.